Hey fam, we gotta do a shout out. Yes, we do. Welcome back to the channel, Dale Snails 40s for we're featuring the family affair. Shout out to Todd Tucker. Yes, 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 yes. Remember Daddy Daycare? He's the salute the wonderful father of Ace Tucker. He just had another one, Blaze Tucker. We're gonna see how cool he is with Blaze. But right now he's doing an excellent job with uh Ace Tucker, okay. First child with candy birds. And we gonna we still we still out for the count when we're talking about uh his daughter Kayla. We we still watching and seeing how that develops, okay? With Candy being at the helm, or she's saying she's trying to be the mediator between them. But that's not why we're calling and we're shouting Todd Tucker out. Ain't got nothing to do with Candy either. He started his own YouTube channel, folks. Yes he did. And I looked at it. I was like, mm -hmm. <laughs> Woo! On a scale of 1 to 10, I gave him a 2. And the only reason why I gave him a 2 is because he tried very hard. But I'm like, Todd, let's talk about this, okay? Let's just seriously talk about this. Now, Candy already has her speak on it. Okay, show. She has Candy Coated Nights. She has Real Housewives of Atlanta and many other avenues of revenue streams she has out there because of her platform of course real housewives of atlanta ah, Todd, she knows how to attract people okay she does high production on her videos okay especially with her youtube thing could you not have taken a little lesson lesson from her I don't even know what you got going on in your intro. I'm like, huh, really? It's almost like you're trying to mimic your wife's um, MO, if you will say, when it comes to her YouTube channel and her intro. Todd, I think if I can say this for me and the 52 year olds and going upward, maybe the youngins uh, will probably agree too. We want to see your flavor. We want to see what you can bring to the screen. Okay, we already know you're nice looking. We know you're uh, a brilliant father when it comes to age. Maybe it's a man thing. Okay, I don't know what you're going to, like I say, I don't know how you're going to be with Blaze. Because we already see what you're doing with Kayla. But Candace not going to let you treat uh, Blaze like you treat Kayla. That's just, <laughs> that's just not going to happen. So, but we try to see what you can do. We don't want you to be including your wife. Or This is just me speaking, okay? Because I don't know what my family going to say. They probably be with me. And then they probably like, no, nah, Dad, we need to see his family. I'm like, no, nah, we already see it on, Can you know, on Candace platform. I'm speak on it. Okay, and when Todd get mad when he's sitting there with her on the couch. And it ain't not just one time he interrupted her like, I thought it was supposed to be Todd and Candy's show. You know, I'm like, damn, you know, Igga. <sighs> but anyway, he finally got a show. And, you know, I understand the first video he put out, he might want to show Candy. He might want to show Ace and anybody else that want to get on. But now, Todd, it's time for you to shine. Okay, not and not to shine on you taking your daughter to a strip club. Okay, not to kind of shine. We don't need it because, you know, we got up in your ass. Okay, we turned you inside and out. We threw you up. We brought you back down. Hard to the floor, the concrete, anything we get. And then we threw you back up to do it again. Okay, so we're in this quarantine type of situation because of, you know, corona and virus. All right, they're kicking ass out there and taking numbers. Okay. But, we're taking names and numbers. But, um, you said from the induction of why you were doing the barbecue, y'all had quarantined you, uh, your family for 14 days or whatnot. I don't know if you really said that, but the quarantine, I think, days to be away from, pe from each other's 14 days, I believe. 12 or 14 days. I haven't been able to do that quarantine or anything. And I don't really want to do it. Praise the Lord. I ain't got it. My family don't have it. Or we don't think we have it at, at this time. We all may be asymptomatic. Okay. But the whole thing is we're not running temps. We don't have to quarantine ourselves. Or it will be a party of, oh, let me see. Six is me and my mom, my daughter and her fiance, and our two dogs. So, yeah, it'll be a party of six. But anyway, we hadn't had the opportunity for our jobs to say, stay y'all behind, stay home, don't come out, don't do nothing until further notice. Okay, but you will get paid. We hadn't heard those words of encouragement. <laughs> so we have to be out there, believe it or not, like the rest of the, um, I guess they deem myself essential 
uh, pieces of the workforce. But anyway, I was pleasantly surprised to see Todd. Yes, that's Patrick over there. He told us Patrick's supposed to be some type of trainer. But I'm like, why do you need a trainer at your house? And why is he there? Okay, why is he there, Todd? Are y'all doing some freaky deaky stuff over there? And you did say Mama Joyce was over there. But I can understand Candy want her mama with her. She don't want her fending for herself. This, that, and the third. So I can see Mama Joyce being there. Okay, quarantining with you all. Then, of course, you had Baby Ace, Baby Blaze, and you had Riley. You didn't really say where Kayla was, so I missed that part in your video. What the hell of Kayla? Was she with her mama? I'm hoping she was with her mama, okay? Because in these days and times, and she ain't really got no real job or whatever. She need to be at home quarantined. So I'm hoping and praying she was with her mother, but she was too empty-headed to even tell us where she was, okay? But anyway, I'm still trying to figure out who is this Patrick, why he's there, and why is he quarantined quarantining with you all don't he have a family but if you don't have a family okay i can see that part but anyway okay y'all tell me what y'all think but anyway todd is over here he just looking like to me a lost fish he really is he looking like a lost fish out there he's trying to cook on some of their property and he don't have the proper equipment he had to keep running back and forth from the main house to where he was trying to cook i'm like damn Todd, why you just didn't cook out in the driveway baby where you had or the other entrance to the next house over there the guest house why you couldn't form your little shelf thing and i don't understand what the hell you were doing and why are you outside in the corona anyway they said an airborne but i have a difference of opinion okay it's gonna get at least 15 minutes worth that air out there and get your ass back in the house okay you know what i'm saying about these celebrities they have the best of all the worlds they can shut down their entity and then they can go and tell us to shut down don't go outside be safe but then they all you know closed it up in their world and and, and they don't have to ah it's just a hot mess you know what i'm saying like they don't need to tell me nothing okay just entertain me okay don't don't, don't tell me that because i'm out here on the front line having not to go to work okay so and when y'all come out here and do stupid shit like this it made me like police go on over there to the birds residence tell them get their behinds back in the house he don't need to be cooking outside or none of that stuff okay like it's a normal day and time we going through and I just think about the babies. I really just think about the babies. I ain't seen Mama Joyce out there not one time. So if she didn't need to be out there. Ace didn't need to be out there, Todd. I'm just saying. But anyway, we're going to go on and see what Celebrity Insider. Because they must have caught the situation on one of their artists or uh, journalist caught it and thought it would be a nice sensational story to uh, report on. So I'm going in in way of in way by uh, Celebrity Insider and the uh, journalist that brought up, brought up well wrote up the story and brought it out to us on Celebrity Insider's platform was none other, none other than Alexis Stone. She titled her article as Candy Burr's husband Todd Tucker shares the barbecue quarantine style video on YouTube. And like I said, he just started his YouTube channel if you like him. If you don't like him and you just know it like me or, you know, I don't have any problem with Todd other than I just want him to stand in his own shit. I want him to make a way for himself and be happy in doing what he's doing, getting up every day and going to make things happen and be a provider. Because I'm like his mom in a sense. If she were living, she wouldn't have Todd stuck up on the uh, Candace ass like he is, you know, following her around like some bodyguard or whatever. She'll be like, uh, you better go get yours, okay? And y'all better get some uh, nannies up in here if y'all feel y'all need to roll like y'all been rolling trying to make money for y'all family and whatnot. Because I ain't finna watch them. I ain't gonna lie. I watch them till y'all can get somebody. But I ain't finna watch them. And then having Mama Joyce and her go at it. And then they might would have found a kind of friendship. They probably had friction here and there when it came to their children interacting and money hands, money and hands being transferred, you know, and all that. She, they probably still had uh, be knocking heads with each other about that. But Mama Sharon wouldn't have been sent. She wouldn't have been uh letting candy run up her son and telling her son he can't do this he can't do that and all this other stuff going on now nah, i don't think that would have been happening and mama joy's probably like no uh-uh and both of them would have been fighting and fussing just like they were fussing in that kitchen scene one time when they was on when she was living and they was uh taping the episode child i thought i would fall out the chair i'm like now give it to me sorry and can't sit your ass down because just watching y'all parents go at it that's just too much for me and i was enjoying all of it okay 
But anyway, let's go on into the article that she wrote up for us. She said, Candy Burris made her fans happy when she announced that Todd Tucker has a new YouTube channel. Fans became even more excited when they found out that he also posted some videos already. Check out the really cool video featuring Todd Tucker. We'll get to that. Someone commented, very entertaining, Todd. I will be watching nice to see the family outside of Housewives. Y'all need a family show. Uh, maybe that comment or didn't understand that they were already getting a side show and just that and the third but like i said i when todd made his own channel i want to see todd i want to see todd's uh perspectives and opinions on matters that are happening in his life living with candy and outside of his life and what he's doing to make his endeavors his money his revenue what you know sh show me how you moving out there todd and then Maybe I can find a newfound respect for you. Right now, you're still in an opportunist type uh, box that I placed you in, okay? Until you can show me something different. Because like I said, you got your own YouTube channel, but yet you're incorporating it around your family. Okay, that was the first two episodes and whatnot. Or the first two videos you put out. The upcoming videos, I need to see you moving and shaking. I need to see you with your boys. Uh, you hanging out with the fellas talking about different uh business opportunities hey I go back over to the trucking company that you call yourself star and that you don't want to be a trucker and all this show show us who really in in charge that you don't put in charge of that endeavor you know show us you make this youtube channel yours okay show us what going right now you always over on candace uh show on real housewives in atlanta telling her what she can't do what she can do what you feel she should be doing uh you know <laughs> we I personally want to see something that you're giving to the family. What you're doing for the family. I want to see these Todd Tucker Productions. I want to see you at Candy Coat at Nights in your office making some things happen. I want to see you signing some contracts on uh, making these movies and films behind the scenes. I want to see you get back in your element because that's what you're saying you're thriving. I want to see you out there cooking in a damn barbecue in a little white beater shirt doing the darn thing. I, we already know Candy got you sold up to be a father. Okay the father of her children all right we already know that and you're doing it i guess 100 percent with ace but you know you complaining too much to be a husband and then uh, on what your wife not doing but you seem like you you know you daddy daycare you 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 you're the mom and candy's dad out there getting that money that bread that trying to provide and we need to see another side that's all i'm saying don't include candy on these videos don't include ace let me see you in your business suit. Let me see you when you're chilling. You, you're hanging with your boys. You're in that kind of uh, gear, wardrobe. Uh, let's see how you prepare for different things. You got to go meet Candy at. You know, how you getting together. How you setting things up. We need to see that, Todd. Then we can have another perspective of you and what you're bringing to the table. Because right now, you're just bringing your two feet. Okay, and your mouth and your hands is what I'm saying. But going back to the article that was written, it says uh, another person posted, I love this, something natural, not rehearsed and not glamorized. You can even show us your daddy daycare session with Ace and Blaze. That little boy was there back in the day. I'm sure he has a lot to say. Someone else said the quarantine is definitely helping us see the family dynamics and a part of Todd's that's generally not in the spotlight as a real live family do and how the Tucker family work well together. On the other, another follower wrote, now Candy, don't be skimping on the greens. I love them with smoked turkey too. Smoked gouda, mac and cheese, mail me a plate. Cute blaze and ace. Congratulations. Happy anniversary. Another person on YouTube said, I can only imagine in my mercy me voice. I mean, can you imagine living like that during quarantine? What a great life. You both have worked so hard for, oh, well, quarantine, I don't know, oh, eight and 47 with salt and pepper. Damn it, candy. Ah, AC pool, so sweet. Uh, damn it, my ovaries. Okay. Someone else said, welcome to YouTube, Mr. Tucker. We don't get to see nearly enough of talk Tucker's clan on Bravo, so I'm excited to see what you have in store for us. Although my post notifications are on, I'm wondering if you'll announce an upload schedule. Please don't be one of those once in a blue moon. Uh-huh. Celebrity. <sighs> Wait a minute, guys. Hey, you need it here uh please don't be one of those once in a blue moon a new moon celebrity wait a minute 
don't please don't be one of those once in a blue new moon celebrity youtubers happy belated anniversary candy made headlines recently when it's been revealed that she is supporting sheree whitfield after her mom went missing okay and i'm like well what are you supporting her with uh candy you give her money she's low on the funds or something girl what's going on did you go out there and do an apb on her mama too missing persons searching everywhere high and low i understand with that little part celebrity insider mrs Alexis stone you didn't make that real clear but okay oh it is what it is but yes 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 okay but yeah todd like i said i gave you the first one was a complete mess. The second one, you gave us a foundation to start on. Meaning the second clip you put out there on YouTube. But now I, I really want to see you. I really want to uh, get into your personality. See what makes you tick. What makes you the person that you say you are. Versus the person we see on TV. Uh, that kind of stuff. So hopefully this helps you to kind of have some insight where... Um, in the world uh give us some kind of insight and give you some type of insight of what we're looking for because that's what we do you ask us what we like to see what we want to see you doing this that or what type of videos we want you to see you know there's some decent commenters will tell you truthfully what they want to see and not all this fluff and mirrors type stuff okay but that's all i have for this video guys y'all get down in them comments let me know what y'all thought about mr todd tucker uh doing his own thing coming out his shell becoming his own man in this television format of entertainment sir i tell you my brother calling me on my phone he called me on my mama's phone oh he know i'm taping i'm not gonna answer him but anyway, okay, that's all I have for this particular video, guys. I will see y'all next time. Y'all be blessed and uh, share and like the videos. Thank you.